If you're like me almost a year ago, you have no clue how to get the steering wheel off. And you have no clue how to replace these. So. That comes off. There's a plug right here. Just unclip that. Now, there's a nut right there. Take that off. Or take it most of the way off. So this is a 19 millimeter. Make sure your wheels are completely straight. As you can see my steering wheel sideways because my alignment's way off. We're gonna loosen this up. But to make it easier, take your key out. And then your dash, or your wheel will lock like that. And then it's gonna be pretty tight, but now you can get it off. You're gonna get it right here, right on the end. And then, as you can see, mine's loose now. Just take both hands, put them behind here, and just pull outwards. You leave that out on there so your wheel doesn't come flying into your face. Now take out this nut. And now your wheel is off. So, now your steering wheel is off. Now you're asking, now what? Well, I need to find my other stocks before I do this, but first of all, you're going to have to unplug all this. So, plug down here. There's another plug on this side, on the right side. Grab that, pull it out. Okay, and then there's one more little plug right here. Find it, pull it out. Okay, now this is all unconnected. And there is one screw on the back here. You're gonna take this out and the whole thing's gonna slide off. I already have gotten it off of here, but basically after you have the screw out enough, you can see there's a little, little tab in here. So this is how it's on there. Look up behind it. You can see this tab right here. Just use a flathead screwdriver. Let's see, push it on here and show you. See now it's stuck on there again. Use a flathead screwdriver back here. Just pry outwards and it'll pop up and then it just slides off. Then here's a new one. Slide it on there. And Obviously, tighten up that screw again. We'll get our wheel bite on here. Now, put your wheel bite on here. Get it on nice and straight. Get your nut on there. Tighten it up. Now, take your cover. If you popped off the edges, now is the time to put a bit on there. Just take it, plug in that clip. Make sure this here is still connected because that's for your horn. Otherwise, it won't horn. Uh, some of you also might not have that clip. Uh, this one does, I think, because it has all these buttons here. But my old car did not. So, just take it, put it on there. Push it on there. Just work your way around. And it's on. Now your steering wheel's on. Hopefully straighter than it was before if you're like me. And now you have new stocks on here. Now I can actually run my horn because this one had a different clip. And that's it. So give it a thumbs up if this helped. And I'll see you next video.